What's up guys? Welcome back to another Steverville food review. Today we stopped by Duncan to try their new signature iced pumpkin latte. Let's check it out. All right guys, here it is. The new signature iced pumpkin latte from Duncan. They're already bringing out the pumpkin spice stuff way, way earlier than they ever have. Uh, both Duncan and everybody else. I mean, they're pushing the pumpkin out. I mean, this pumpkin, pumpkin. I don't know if the pumpkin king would be okay with this. This is way, way before October. I remember when it was always like the first week in October before any of the pumpkin spice stuff came out. And then it just went like crazy. It keeps getting pushed further and further back. Sooner or later, we're going to be having pumpkin spice lattes while we watch fireworks for the 4th of July. <laughs> but anyway, let's get into this new signature pumpkin spice latte new signature indicates that it's new and i guess so in a way it is because they've changed a few things with it i'm using this as a wand like uh i don't know i guess like it's close to halloween i've got like a halloween type shirt on from halloween horror nights got pumpkin right here might as well be like a little wand this has pumpkin spice it has vanilla it has espresso whole milk or you can get almond milk or anything else that you can milk you can throw that in there too uh, topped with cool whip drizzled with caramel and then it has cinnamon sugar on top so the big i guess like the big big difference is that they added vanilla to it and i think that that's going to be a plus i think it's actually going to make it more uh like a pumpkin pie flavor that's what i'm hoping anyway let's find out oh yeah yeah i am a pumpkin spice fan uh I, when when uh the coffee places just started coming down to the south uh, I remember getting lattes and cappuccinos when we lived in Italy. And so when it first started coming down south, uh, I was so ready to get one of the cappuccinos, one of the lattes. Starbucks started popping up a little bit in in like the, the bigger cities just outside of where I live. What I'm getting to is I've been drinking pumpkin spice cappuccinos and lattes as far back as it goes as far back as it like it hit this area and uh this is probably the best pumpkin spice coffee beverage that i've ever had now normally i'll drink the hot coffee the the hot latte with the pumpkin spice because it kind of i, I don't know like it releases the flavors better when it's hot but I like this right here, so it makes me now want to try the hot version, the, the hot espresso lattes. I definitely will be doing that. But this is really, really good. Like I said, uh, that it would probably lean more toward the pumpkin pie flavor. If you like pumpkin pie, you're going to love this right here. This is really, really good. The, um, the price on it, I'm trying to remember, this is a... This is a medium. Let me pull my my receipt. I was about to say coupon. Let me pull my receipt back up. All right. So the medium was uh, $4.29. And then after that pumpkin king tax, it brought it to $4.63. So, uh, you know, it, yeah, it's a little, little pricey. But all your coffee and beverages especially anything made with espresso is going to be a little pricey this is a good size medium so for that price uh i can definitely do it especially with this flavor and now i'm, I'm kind of eating my own words in in the fact that i was kind of complaining that it came out early but but it just gives me more time to drink these uh yeah it, the only the only problem is that the ushering in of the pumpkin spice flavored stuff always 
like let me know that uh that fall was here halloween was right around the corner so as i'm drinking this now like i'm i, I want to go to halloween horror nights even though it is canceled this year but i will be trying to make it down to hallow screams in tampa florida i'm just telling you early because there's going to be some videos coming out from hallow screams uh, if i get the ticket get the reservation and they don't cancel the event but back to the pumpkin spice latte this thing is really really good signature pumpkin spice latte try to mix the cool whip that cinnamon sugar a little bit of caramel in there too get that inside there see if that actually makes it even closer to the pumpkin pie because that's what I always wish that the pumpkin spice lattes and cappuccinos would taste like would be more like pumpkin pie man that is so so good that is really really good for people that probably lean away from the pumpkin spice stuff because most of them have like a really really strong spice like the nutmeg uh, and uh, the allspice kind of flavor this is not that drink if you like the pumpkin pie flavor but you stay away from the drink usually because it's too overpowerful with the spices give this one a try uh, this one this one is not that ordinary pumpkin spice beverage this is definitely my new favorite I'm gonna say let me get one more sip uh, I don't even need to but I'm going to uh, because I want to mmm man that is so good that is really really good all right on a scale of one to ten for the new signature pumpkin spice latte hot or iced you can get it either way i think you know where i'm going i'm gonna give this one a 10 well deserved they should have just called it pumpkin pie changed the whole game gone away from pumpkin spice the the psl uh, whole crave they should have just called it pumpkin pie the new signature pumpkin pie latte would have been perfect uh, but as it is it's a great flavor i really like the additage of the vanilla because that really just changed everything i think that's what kind of toned the the uh overpowerful spice spices that usually come with the pumpkin spice latte i think the vanilla is what actually did it so uh yeah kudos to duncan man they they really nailed it on this one they made a uh, a new favorite for me and i will definitely absolutely be getting these on the regular and i hope that they stay all the way through the end of the year probably not but uh, I hope they do because I'll, I'll definitely be getting these on the regular from now on. So anyway, that is my view of the new signature pumpkin spice iced latte from Dunkin'. With that, I say good day.